this is a very young bird. Uh, this is one of the black crowned night herons. It's not so unusual to see a rescued baby bird, but it's quite a sight when you find 10 on the ground every day. I actually just saw a bird drop, actually, just right over there, just to the left of that tree. Since May, hundreds of herons and egrets have moved into the grounds of Tuscaro Apartments in Natomas, where they've certainly left their mark just about everywhere. They're making themselves at home for nesting season, and technically these animals were here first. So Natomas used to be a big wetland, and so they've probably been nesting here for decades. A lot has changed in the neighborhood, forcing these birds to adapt with many close calls. And you can see, oh God. Yeah, they're so young and inexperienced, they don't recognize the danger. Wildlife experts say the mortality rate out here is close to 90%. Part of that is nature. The siblings jostle for, you know, feed me, feed me, and then they're, um, they knock each other out of the trees. Other times, it's environment. They fall into the hard surfaces and break bones, and then there's all the cars. You have a six-lane road. And when this happens, volunteers come to the rescue. We rescue them in the middle of the night. We put them in our showers and little boxes so they sleep there, and we keep them cool. Resident Gabe Harris has become a pro at handling the wildlife and says he's happy to coexist until the end of nesting season next month. And the birds remind me of being at the harbor and, and the smell did remind me kind of being at the beach down in, in Santa Cruz.